Hallelujah. Afi, papa, reverence, tum, dio, dio, yentem. 
Bon se manesa, bon se manesa, bon se manesa na wosere, and bon se keke na odi dede bi krampo e kaho, bon se, amen. Afin suye ma meni e papa e wachi e life, amu wachi e life, fa se mbo e mo amusa, fa se mbo amusa se abrini abrini na amu taichi, amu share e, fa se mbo amusa, amen, amen. Time as so, and the infant sembo, and she I am papa reverend said to do do na amen. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That was to that was a rather man or a coma, a bubu, and find you was some more. What he says, Christ demo, and I'm a bomb pie. I dominate it. Amen. Amen. Who just swear? Amen. Patriot Nassi. Nassi. Amen. Eda Unyanko Pon Assi, Bibri, Se, and then so. Amen. All right, so um, we are still in the month of Constitution, the Constitution month. Anyway, into Egususunya, the vision of the church and the beliefs of the church, the beliefs of the church. Into for a couple of weeks now, no. We've been talking about the vision of the church. The vision of the church. Last week, the first vision. Vision and you saw the a war as a free mode, you did kind of a soul winning. And to your chassis, a can one somehow it is necessary, sir. You've been winning souls for the kingdom of God. In the part and so I've been who on Yanko Pon, a high, any on Yanko Pon, Nenquaji, a the priority of the church. The priority of the church is to win souls. The priority of the church is to win souls. Into soul winning is the first, the first vision of the church is soul winning. And it is the priority. And today, you know, everything we are doing in the church, you know, is geared towards the winning of souls. All the other visions, the main aim is to be winning souls. Soul winning is the, is the primary vision of the church. Now, after that, no, you for church planting, and we spoke about the need, say, we have to feed the flock. And in order for us to feed the flock, no, it is necessary. Say, we will gather them in a place so that we can feed the flock. It is necessary, say, you better gather them. Now, yet to me, a feeding flock, no. Because you cannot feed the flock when they are scattered. You can only feed when they are together. So, we put them in a church. We put them in a, in a place so that we can feed them. What do we feed them with? We can feed them with the word of God. We can guide them. We can direct them. So, the church is a very important place. Very, very important. The church is a spiritual clinic. Anybody who is, who is not saved, spiritually, not on your sound. When you have won them over, it is necessary to say, so that whatever the sickness is, so many. 
And it's all back Christo Mua. Or back Christo Mua. And it's necessary to say, we'll be feeding with the word of the Lord. Say, you be ya, then you be ban a hosso, then you be be. Amen. And we bring the people to church in order to enlighten them. And see, church are very important. Church are very important. When people come to church, because of church, no, I mean, I'm church, no, so every raise a lot of people are. Ideally, no, anka in pempensu blu anko mundu. But through the church, I mean, I'm a sorry, no, so I didn't pay the bill, the bill ni pabra bo. Through the church, no, a lot of people would identify their gifts and their talents, their callings. A lot of us in church, you know, say, say, yeah, I'm sorry, and yeah, but yeah, and can grace be one man, can we may never discover it. And can talent be one man, can MP, eh? And can, and can who we are here, and can one camera now be able to capture. We can one camera. One keyboard now can be able to capture. One microphone now be able to know. And can be there when Christ so be to me preach. So I'm ma, I'm sorry, yeah. A better than Cabin who said, O Nan Copa, one more, don't want a beer, say, O be won't, O be a rear, or don't sat on a swa, O be a yarissa. Where did you find that? That gift, that calling was on earth in church. So we have to gather people in order to reveal them, in order to take off a debia, a catomoso, a debia catomoso, no, in the sense, eh, Anka. A debia a peer or a bra bosso and then one can who can pee. Hallelujah. Yes, years ago, about four years, five years ago, imagine your situation then. Maybe an hour. Maybe an hour. It is church that you came. And now, and your ma and don't be a shas a peer or a bra bosso. And then they would see me a baby away and be free. And can pee. So when you bring people to church, Church planting helps to build the individual, both physically and spiritually. Because we teach both physically, you know, the other day when we were talking about uh, resource incompatibility. And no, and yes, spiritual, uh, physical, physical, medical, physical. And see, you gain knowledge physically. Physical knowledge, you gain. Spiritual knowledge, you gain it. You know, emotional knowledge. Sometimes we tell you how to manage your emotions. So we'll be, we'll be gaining that knowledge. All these things, you know, when you come to church, it's, it's part of the benefits you enjoy. The church, the church is a very important place. So we believe in church planting. There are, there are a couple of churches that we know, say, you know, the pastor says, as for me, I know how people can be disloyal. Who be a sorry man? Now, or yeah, yeah, star, star, so we who are no affa. Indeed, there are some big churches in the country that they don't believe in church planting. Church planting, they don't believe in it. Indeed, no, Kesia Bakuna Wohon and Noah, everybody should come and worship. Oh, Pesso, Ufi, Tamale, Ufi, Nabrungu, and if I now Pesso worship with the church, I come to where the main church is. Hallelujah. That is the idea of the man of God. But we also believe that it is important. Say, to the doorstep of the individual. We believe in that. So we, we plant churches so that the word of God can reach out to the doorstep of the individual. I don't quanta. I am for every over thirty something branches. Every is scattered everywhere. Into baby, I will be here. You can attend. Hallelujah. So it is important that we build churches, we plant churches. One of the areas are a shapey, unipa character. Hey, I'm sorry, church. So we plant churches. So that we can also help shape the character of the individual. We can help shape the character of the individual. No, nobody teaches character formation in school. You only go and teach biology. 
science, integrated science. Again, again, again. But to teach an individual how to behave, how to have a good character is in church. So character formation is one of the functional roles of the church. Character formation. So nobody can say, say, the church is not important. Building churches, planting churches is not important. Character formation. In school, even if they can teach you one or two things you are supposed to do or not to do, they cannot sustain it. Because what will sustain the character of a person, help shaping the character of a person, is the word of God. And you can only get it, you get the word of God in church. Amen. And the church is a very important place. Therefore, it is necessary for us to plant more churches. So the second mission of this church is church planting. Church planting. A lot of people had their life partners in church. At least, if you have your life partner, you select your life partner from church, you can guarantee, you can be guaranteed, at least, kakrase. Onipana we nyano no, osho nyame kakra. So, eba kete kakra, obeti ye nyame ne, obeti ye ni sofo, obeti ye ni leader. Hallelujah. So it's better to get a life partner in church than in the nightclub. <laughs> While being a life partner or nightclub, no? you know what you are in for. Uh, you know what you are in for. As a matter. As a matter. I know couples when when they met in the nightclub and they were trying to work out things. When they got married, Anna or Barney fell through. I feel they're in the football, so then they ain't in. Point me in the night club with the pregnancy. Bear man, he said, The first I want you to know does not restrict me from going to the night club. Ain't he? We're just about paying for it to feel. No, I call night club. I call night club, but no pack, no abba. You will never be happy. Because. The area where you chose a life partner does not guarantee your safety. The church is a safe place. So, planting churches helps the individuals in the church to, to be able to lead a better life. So, planting churches is one of our, it's our second vision, the second vision of this church. Hallelujah. All right, so today we are talking about the third mission of the church. Deliverance from the works of the devil. Deliverance from the works of the devil. Luke chapter 4 verse 18. Read Luke chapter 4 verse 18. Deliverance from the works of the devil. We'll look at some of the works of the devil very soon. Deliverance from the works of the devil. Are we there? Luke chapter 4, verse 18. Deliverance from the works of the devil. The spirit of the Lord is upon me because he has anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He has sent me to heal the brokenhearted and to preach deliverance to the captives. To preach deliverance to the captives. So, deliverance from the works of the devil. People that have been put under captivity. So, it is the duty of the church, the vision of the church, to preach deliverance, bring deliverance to people that have been held captive by the devil, people that have been held captive, and the recovering of sight to the blind, 
and to set at liberty them that are bruised. So, deliverance from the works of the devil. Deliverance. So, in, in our church, we believe that anybody that is under captivity should be delivered. That is what the church stands for. We deliver people that are under bondage. Hallelujah. Now, one of the ways uh, is to preach false doctrine to you. False doctrine. False doctrine. One of the dangerous things are uh, a nipa and false doctrine. And chirachira boni. And chirachira boni. So deliverance from the devil, deliverance from false teachings and false doctrines. Mental slavery. So these are the things that uh, we, we, we stand as a church to deliver people from. So be one more. People don't know. So a lot of people believe that as now being a deliverance, no, I just say you may be a kick and kick out. You may be a year your own answer. I just say you be a castle of Fabi B. Brian, Fabi B. 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 Answer. The word of God is enough. The blood of Jesus is enough. So, if you are not at liberty in your mind, then you will begin to think, say, I just say, Mammy, be be answer. I just say, I can't say, I can't be answer. Say, I can't say, I can't be be the answer. Say, I didn't ever. It is not the truth. So, preaching the truth, identifying the truth, and preaching it to the people of God delivers them from the bondage of the devil. So we read the other day, John 6 verse 30. And you shall know the truth, and the truth shall set you free. What sets people free, the man free, is not the materials, it is the word of God. It is Jesus. Jesus, when you are able to identify him, he will set you free. Amen. 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 Oh. Hallelujah. So, you shall know the truth. A lot of people have hidden the truth. For their own selfish interest. Also, funny him say, So, catch it out, say, Obon Paya Nyamiti Ewa. On time, Bani, Hono News, Ka. Into your expertise, say, Bibia, just wait, Ranya Bani, Ho. No, I catch out, say, Kofa, A, B, C, D, Bra. I mean, Bibi Mao. I mean, fan fra fra mao. But the truth of the matter, he said, while we are church member, also we are in Yanko Ponso for, we are in Yanko Ponso for, we are in Yanko Ponso Amen. Hello? I said, I said, we are in Yanko Ponso for, 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 we are in Yanko Ponso we say, hey, me, me, bonnie, me, bonnie. Bonnie, I'm deep. I'm not sure so, but I'm crazy. I'm not sure. 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 I just said, I'm not sure. 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 I'm not now my yes, so so and so, and so now umu beto dia. It is a lie. That is mental slavery. Mental slavery. If you are in church, obon pa yenya miti. Amen. No. See, there, are, there are maybe a, a few circumstances are. Uh, you would need somebody with a higher grace. No abe mo amal. That one and so ho. But maybe be a na simple thing be a one kasa kwa ujidi wain. And I know now, yes, we see both, both new and I ship new ma, na and from a case be bo. I say na mujidi we, ye men of little faith. It means say, Jesus was expecting say, they will rebuke the wind themselves, not to come and call him. Amen. So the the 
the ideal church, the ideal situation is where the pastor is able to train his members such that there are certain situations that who hear so be bani ho. Amen. Am the make and can ye. So we train you. We, you have to learn how to pray. Into the be aye bomb pie bomb pie no aye for fun no. You are being trained how to pray. Also for now, I be calling you. I say, also for me here, so so and so. Into boam any way no. Oh no, only she aye pie bomb na. Into so chair I said the bomb pie idea. And you're in difficult situations, you no. Know, you also have to pray. Don't be looking elsewhere. Amen. No. So you you have to learn how to pray because we teach you how to pray. We teach you how to study the word. You also have to learn how to do it. So that you can be strong enough to be able to resist the devil. You too. Not the pastor alone. You should be able to. So, if you are, you are being taught all these things, you know, it brings you freedom. You will be free. And you will quite say, Rebecca said, Church member, he knew more. Oh, problem bar. For a thousand Ghana. For who so for no child, yeah, yeah. Anybody, if a pastor is teaching you that, it's not biblical. Biblical. There are some people, uh, even their own church members. Oh, because who no cry with you. Because who so for. Say, be a care, why hey. Now, be a bit of a drink, so, and I say, or how be now, so, who, yeah, papa. I say, ask now, baby, who, you know. You bet you are 2,000. Oh, person who me, Philly, Philly, one on one, there. Yeah. Hey, yeah, 4,000. <laughs> hey, I can bet you the papa. <laughs> hey, yeah, 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 sorry, we are not lying. Tin, 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 tin. <laughs> I can bet her. But that is not the, the, the issue. Yes, you say, Peter, so dumb, dear. Then keep the sheep. Keep the sheep means that say be be how mo a e wose wo hwe na otnet ne no make sure so omo nko how mo amen so deliverance from the works of the enemy deliverance don't allow we, we don't entertain or condone people who enslave people by giving them false doctrines so we try to preach the truth a kind of credit you Say the bear, also one dream will know a bear fine. Your spirit man will be free so that you can be a good Christian. Amen. So, deliverance, a very important Colossians chapter 1, Colossians 1, verse 13. Colossians chapter 1, verse 13. Colossians 1, verse 13. Colossians 1, verse 13. Shall I say free verse 12? Go back to verse 12, please. So that we can understand it well. Giving thanks unto the Father who has made us meet to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light. Giving thanks unto the Father who has made us meet to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light. Verse 13. Uh Uh-huh. Who has delivered, delivered us from the power of darkness and has translated us into the kingdom of his dear son. So we were not only delivered. After we were delivered, he translated us into the kingdom of his dear son. Hallelujah. Amen. So Jesus Christ delivered us the death of christ and sure said we were delivered from the power of darkness the power of darkness it soon to me i say ye 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 effi it soon to me i say tell your christonia it soon they do so what she soon will be on your christonia be on fire yesu say new rea and then i jink will be on a she soon now she soon so i bet they say oh bet me i don't I just said what for Jesus. No, I far away from assuming him. Where you from assuming him? Not the one by a high No, that, until you come to the light, 
you've not started life. Any man that is still in darkness is yet to start life. Because in the darkness, no, the first place, no, you don't have life. You don't have life. You don't have life. You don't have life. That is why sometimes, no, eh, yeah, say, Mithye, um, there's, there are some ministers who evangelize and they call, the altar call. No? Say, come and give your life to Christ. Come and give your life to Christ. No, the one who has not accepted Jesus does not have life. So he cannot give his life to Jesus. So come and accept Jesus. Come and accept life. Hallelujah. If you give your life to, G- to Jesus, it means you have life. But the one who has not accepted Jesus does not have life. So, Jesus Christ delivers us from the works of the enemy, from the power of darkness, so that he will translate us into the kingdom, his kingdom, the kingdom of light. Amen. And he says, Yes, you Christ, you are the one and you are the one who is 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 the How are we going to do that? We are going to preach to them. We are going to deliver them. Say, it is, it is possible, say, somebody can be in church, but will be under the influence of the enemy. Obi was sorry. But on Timmy, Obi was sorry, Onye Juma ye. Obi was sorry, Abrabono, Wake Chilewum. Obi was sorry, so many things are happening to the person. So the church, CCCW, you know, one of our main duties is that. For anybody that is under the power of darkness, we will help the person out of the darkness and translate them into the kingdom of Jesus. Amen. When you see somebody under the influence of the enemy, influence of the devil, no, so who said, Man, don't insult the person. Don't insult the person. The vision of this church is to help people like that. Amen. 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 This way, hallelujah. And I want more sorry. They make an one they make an answer. Yeah. So we should we should be compassionate. You know, we should be we should be compassionate because we have been called as a church. For people like that, we have been called. It is the vision of the church. It is the assignment of the church to help deliver people who are under the influence of the devil, the works of the devil. But scripture says, for this purpose, in 1 John 3 verse 8, for this purpose, the Son of Man was manifest that he should destroy. 1 John 3 verse 8, destroy the works of the enemy or the devil to destroy. So the son of God, Jesus, was manifest in order to destroy the works of the devil. So he that committed sin is of the devil. For the devil sins from the beginning. For this purpose, the son of God was manifested that he might destroy the works of the devil. So the third vision of this church is that we want to bring deliverance from the works of the devil. Anybody under the influence of the devil, the power of sin, will be broken in the lives of the people. It is the responsibility, the vision of this church. Amen. So, I, I expect you to understand this one. So, when you a juma, a shawon, sir, who share a juma now, be the pepe pepe. Don't, don't only criticize. Don't only laugh at people. Amen. Number four. Number four. Matthew. 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 
Oi. É. É na, na assim sua O fio. Oi, tu quai. Ok. All right. Number four. Number four. The fourth vision is to exercise dominion over the power of darkness. So it goes back to the same thing there. It goes back to the same thing. Dominion over the power of darkness. Genesis 1 verse 26. Let's look at the scripture that backs this vision. Genesis 1, 26 to 28. Genesis 1, 26 to 28. Are we there? Genesis 1, 26 to 28. All right. And God said, let us make man in our image after our likeness and let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, over the fowl of the air, and over the cattle, and over all the earth, and over every creeping thing that creeps upon the earth. Verse 27. So God created man in his own image. In the image of God created he him. God is a representation of dominion. And he, he created man in his image. So he gave him dominion over the earth and the space. And he, every man created in the image of God is supposed to have dominion over the power of darkness. Colossians chapter 1 verse 13, we just read that. Luke chapter 10 verse 19. Luke 10 verse 19. Luke 10 verse 19. I'm speeding up a little because I have to. Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. Over all the power of the enemy. Tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. And nothing shall by any means hurt you. Nothing shall by any means. That is dominion. Exercise dominion over everything, including the power of the enemy. It says over all the power of the enemy. So in, in proper grammatical terms, no? Say, okay, say, over all the power. Are you wrong? I also okay, say, over all the powers of the enemy. Hallelujah. Oh, oh. So you should say over all the powers of the enemy. But the King James, the Bible is saying over all the power. It means say, power of for no ebit me exercising in a can in a boom into a bako. And you see, exercise authority over it. The devil does not have powers. He has trickery. Or bet that thou. If the devil does not trick you on now, if the devil would, would have access to you, I just say one castle man the coin. Hallelujah. So one man the coin, a bonny for no to me now, won't me in your bonny be other. So we give access to the enemy, to the devil. When he tricks us, he makes things that are dreadful, that are supposed to kill us, he makes it attractive to us. And we follow it. Deception. So, the only thing the devil knows how to do is to deceive people. And that is his power. Deception. And he, if you are able to understand how it works out, and you are able to overcome the deception of the enemy, then you can overcome him. I give you power unto you. Power. You tread on serpents and scorpions. Serpents and scorpions. Serpents are dreadful. Scorpions are poisonous. So anything that is poisonous and dreadful, see, I give unto you power to tread on them. You have 
power over them. Scorpions and serpents. And over all the power of the enemy. Deception of the enemy. We are to exercise dominion. So we, we believe as a church, say, the church exercises dominion over the devil. One of the reasons why every time people are looking out for the fault. I didn't hear. I'm on Tia Sia. The Pensonia media are for neighbor court, and now so they are for neighbor court. I'm on Tia Sia. Ah, you know, more power. A gentleman be doer. I'm on Tia Sia. So they will fight you. But as Dan Kenya may say, he has given us power. We have the dominion. We exercise dominion over the works of the enemy. Hallelujah. Ain't he, sir? Be be a your bonny for any new we believe, sir, God has given us that authority to exercise dominion over it. Whatever it is. It is now we pray for the person. God has given us authority over sickness. Has given us authority over the works of the enemy. Dominion. So we exercise dominion. Amen. So if you are a member of this church, you should understand how to exercise dominion. Amen. God has given the church dominion. And you are the church. Oh, And you are the church. So we exercise dominion. Amen. If you are you must understand your position here. Say, say, we should exercise dominion over the work the works of the enemy, dominion over the powers of darkness. Amen. Let's read Daniel chapter 7, verse 22. Daniel 7, verse 22. Daniel 7, verse 22. Are we there? Until the ancient of days came and judgment was given to the saints of the Most High. And the time came that the saints possessed the kingdom. The saints possessed the kingdom. It means that the saints exercised dominion. If you're able to possess, I say until the ancient days came and judgment was given to the saints of the Most High God. It means that when judgment is given to you, it means you bore a seminar mouth. It means one hour to me. Amen. Say, in the Pamir, no air press as a home, Neku, a copy of quarter. Yet, three months one finally, no, see, boy, assembly, we are the idea as a neighbor man. No, or no, to me so cross as a so. Amen. You said they make a note as yet. Hello. Ain't he judgment was given to the saints of the Most High, and the time came that the saints possessed the kingdom. The saints possessed the kingdom. It means that the saints exercise dominion. If you don't have powers, the, the, the power to exercise it, you cannot exercise. Once judgment has been given to us, it means we have power to exercise dominion and to possess what belongs to us. Amen. All right. Number five. I want to finish this one, so I, I hope we can finish. Number five, to reach out to the poor and the needy. The fifth, number five, vision of the church is to reach out to the poor and the needy in the society through the teachings of sound biblical doctrine and other humanitarian activities. Other humanitarian activities. Activities. So we want to reach out to the poor and the needy. You know, it is very easy to lure people that are poor and needy. Hallelujah. Obia, oh need you obedi, oh need your best channel. Say Obi catch then he say, I just say onu so bolo, and sin ama mauska obedi nechi. You know a lot of the deception I cause you and then no, maybe no no, because people are poor, 
So they will go to a place where you pour one. Or for number teacher fried rice among. Or so for number teacher drinks. If you are more muska, if you are more more so so and so. And some of my pass sorry no. It is or call no ma. The whole time of our church in the moon, I am man communion that. The whole time of our church in the moon, I am yeah man no, yeah man no baptism. Yeah man no any sound biblical teachings we are. But you be ginti obeko. Ye po wa. Ye be chiche fried rice inti obeko. Or dene obe sang in the men na sing a ko. Adi inti ya. The poor and the needy. O need you be di. O need you be she. Inti obeko na ya da da no. O be di sika be da da no. O be di bibi be da da no. Memo e juma be da da no. So. One of the areas that are very important to us as a church, they say, we want to reach out to the poor and the needy. The first thing I have is the sound biblical doctrines. And then after that, we do humanitarian activities. In our church, you know, I don't know if there's any church in this locality here. I bought church members in the whole car. Let's say, yeah, sorry. We pay fees. We, we do so many things. We pay hospital bills. Establish people in businesses. This church, eh? Oh, na me should I? And sometimes, you no. Know, unfortunately, people even want to take advantage of the situation. People want to take advantage. TV one more, or call hospital. Now, hospital bill, you say a hundred Ghana. No, I'm afraid. Say, you say hospital bill, no, it's kind of five million. Or so for sending mommy. We do so much. Everybody knows it in town. And I know. Yeba, <laughs> sorry. Na, eh, Papa B, or yeah, on your church member. The pump and or buy it. Or so for, no one come up. Mrs. Sir. I send me number. No fair, could you know better than I say? Or say, me bang ya school, I will be called. Let me see counsel. Inti mi ni obi gusu bo bo hu na no ka kire mi se membra mo asori mu ha na me ba ha dia o si ah se se me ba mo asori ha ko a dia me nye ska de me ba na ko school inti enu nti ya na ma ba ei afege asem na bo mi pusa mi mi hu de me nka na bi san se ani Let me check into a new so bad genie. Let me say, Papa, I'm sorry. Oh, quite sorry. I say, I now quite sorry, Ben. And I'm sorry, Nidi. I'm saying, Oh, quite sorry, na who here am one. I don't know, uncle, most of all. I say, Hold the side in the video. You hold the Oma come, I have to say, I'm sorry, Uncle, for school fees. And she said, We are one that was all quiet, Juma. Now this kind of brass, sorry, and you are sorry now about bed one horse. I know my catcher. I hold them a quam and you say, Mean a bit. And the hand will be chair, I say. I had the mutual uncle for school fees, pa, and Simon Braha. Hey, that's awful. Now, school fees, no, so you are here. Three thousand five. Oba one day pay oba three thousand five. No more muti muda dani ina oma dia he. Oh, say yo, what can what can mate? We dey cut. We be ready na me be ye. Why? Say cut. Say na no be say about sorry ni biuma mi ni. Think in grandpa say ebia. We dey anko pes kenti umbra kakra anka ho ana. Ebi obe ba mi nu ana mi ense biya kaho. Na e say sad dana obe ji anko di ko. Church. And see, people even know in town, say, the church is into humanitarian activities. Hey, yeah, Chicheska. The church. We'll be here more, no money be. We'll be here school fees. Church, no. Church, the church has a policy. Ah, yeah. The amount of money that goes out in fees. Perpetua. Yeah, 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 yeah
But uh, yeah, one of the assignments of the church. Remember yeah, the necessary grace, sir. You bet me that for failing. Hallelujah. Amen. So when people become vulnerable, uh, it's easy to deceive them. But the church, CCCW, is in place that so will teach people the right things. Let's read Proverbs chapter 19, verse 17. Proverbs. Proverbs 19, verse 17. Proverbs chapter 19, verse 17. I think that will be the last scripture. We will read more scriptures when we meet. He that has pity upon the poor lends unto the Lord, and that which he has given will he pay him again. It's a very powerful scripture. Proverbs chapter 19, verse 17. A very powerful scripture. He that Pity has pity upon the poor. Obia ohu ohi eni mo bono. I say obo onyango pon besiya. Hey, na she onyango pon kakrakei. Na onipa ti se me ti se o ni abo nyame besiya. Ono a sikani di te na ayani dia. Se uti mi bo o sikani besiya dia. Na she se uyo sikani wankasa. What you say? Hello. Why not the American answer? So to me, bo osikeni bisiya. Not just so yeskeni, because osikeni be 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 pe bisiya wawa. I'm be pe sika kitwa. Now one man osikeni aba say mami five billion dollars. You wey na wey? If you know me bo ten cities and now two cities bisiya, no. I be bo kesiye. Inti se what to me ma osikeni bisiya wey yeskeni. Now. I see, sir, who obia or your mob oda or dread the trena, who the mob a ye on young coupon and our bonnet bessia. Now, that which he has given, will he pay him again? Me, sir, Oma obia or you hear me, mob, obia your mob, obia your needy, O man in moi, on young coupon bessia mouth. God will repay you back. You see? And you know when God is going to repay you back, if you give one, he will not give you one. He will give you more than one. Hallelujah. Ain't you know? And you're very necessary, sir. We understand this one. And it's one of our visions, the fifth vision of the church. And he said, I was society in the we will give them what they need. Help them. As we do this for them, you know, the Bible is saying that God will pay us back again. Sometimes, you know, we enjoy diverse kinds of grace, but we don't know how it came. There's one of them. Obia, owo abadaye, ema omu o nibi, omu omu ye, omu ye, needy in the society, needy in the church, you know, you are in partnership with God. Hallelujah. You are in partnership. Because it is like and He will pay you back. Hallelujah. So the church CCCW no And God is always proving his word to the church. Always. Because sometimes, no, and your ma, when you come on, and now, when I don't so, and your ma, a peer, and what's happening, you know, a brother, you need to And you ask yourself, say, if you, this is one of them. Because we engage in humanitarian activities, yeah, yeah, do yeah, 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 a boy, you know, when you come on, so make sure, say, yeah, you know, 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 yeah, he gives to us. Amen. So, that is the fifth humanitarian activities to reach out 
to the needy, the poor and the needy in the society. So as we teach them sound biblical doctrines, we also help them physically. You know, the doctrines we teach you know, is to help shape them spiritually. But physically, you know, we have to attend to the physical needs of the church member and to the society. And I know not, Papa, a, Papa a discuss it. some of the things that person here here in our community, no? one of them, and he said, person here two boreholes. Boreholes. A bit boy, because there are people that have no access to portable water cramp on them. You see, Papa, how many be? So, you yeah, drill a borehole in our society anymore. It will help the people in the society. Hallelujah. Yeah. So, you were saying, so, you have to it's one of the humanitarian activities. And God says that anybody who reaches out to the poor, he will pay him back. He will, he will give you back whatever you lost. Then now, let's also delve into this vision. Amen. Said the bear, when young coupons in the neighbor Jay home, and I say, Yes, you could be sent with via or to me that domain. God will pay us back. Amen. When I miss now, who are questioning be an hour contribution, be you can bring it up. I'm ending now. Question Contribution Question Say, any penny be brave, could leave. Could leave. Wow. Yes, question. Okay. Are you in a wati? What's the day in there? Can you see any uncle? Very good. Hey, a call. What about the point? Yes. Yes. Uh huh. Could you? What's again? Exercise dominion. Okay, very good. My view. Osborne, what's again? Yeah. Deliverance from the west of the devil. Okay. Esther, what's your again? If you help the needy, you are in partnership with God. Very good. When I'm saying, I'm here tomorrow. Next week, I'm going to be here. You better sign it. She's not here to us. So, next week, we'll go into the beliefs of the church. We'll go into the beliefs of the church. Because uh, we have so many things to learn. And, you know, I'll be, run, I'll be going very fast. Sunday, I'm here tomorrow. 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 I'm here Hallelujah. You are for there. You are for there. Let's close. Our time is gone. Everybody that was sick. That is some for the Eba when you should also F my Domia and Abway be sick up on F my that we used to them. Amen. Come and give your offering. Friday I'm at my evening service. Ebe Basso. Evening service. Ebe Basso. Into seven o'clock.